Tuesdays, Lou Swimming, time to meet our final guest. One is a six foot two inch ex rugby player. <laughs> I know. The other is a very dainty five foot two professional dancer, but they've been paired together for this year's Strictly Come Dancing. And despite their obvious height difference, it doesn't seem to have stopped them dazzling on the dance floor. <laughs> Christina Rianol. <laughs> Six weeks in and you're still there on Strictly. Yeah, I think I'm on borrowed time a bit, but no. uh, I've got to say, yeah, it's... Uh, no uh, way. Thank you, everyone. I think everyone here voted for you, didn't you, I girls? Did I did. Yeah, not everyone's nodding, though. <laughs> Enjoying it, though. I, 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 the first two weeks were terrifying. And... Um, I sort of turned the turn corner on the third week, and now I'm starting to really enjoy it. But it's like letting go of that inhibition, mm. sort of going out there and just going for it is, is really hard. And I've never, I've, I've come from the drunken stumble. I've never danced before in my entire life. <laughs> wow. And um, so that's going the out there. And, club routine, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that, that's just normally head nod and, <laughs> and drinking. But yeah, so it completely alien to me. And what's, it was uh, what's been your favourite dance so far? Actually, I struggle to be in hold. I struggle to the ballroom. Oh, I could teach you. <laughs> <laughs> you could teach me any time. <laughs> so, yeah, I like more of the Latin, the dry hump inside of things. No, I'm mean, only kidding. Too early for that, sorry. No, it's not. <laughs> what are you going to do this Saturday? What dance are you We're doing? dancing the Paso Doble. Oh. The Paso Doble. The Paso Doble dance. <gasps> we'll so. Be good for that. Is that I think it's going to be a good Is that one. a bit macho, that one, Christina? Yes, yes. Uh -huh. It's uh, very much a man's dance where he has to be dominant and very strong and aggressive. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> However, he's a bit Everything of a softie. He's a very nice guy, so I have to make him look very aggressive and sort of mm -mm. strong and passionate. So, yeah. Mm. Christina, yeah. what are his strengths and weaknesses? Because you've danced with a wide uh, selection of part yeah. partners. You've had professional sportsmen, you had yeah. Jason Donovan. Yeah. yeah. Do you think sportsmen <laughs> are, are, are make good partners? I think they do because I think the mentality, you know, the work ethic is really great. You know, they go to the studio and work really, really hard. And that's a massive plus. I guess the challenges are that... Yeah, with him. <laughs> yeah, what's your biggest challenge? Um, you know, he's the beginner, he's never danced before, but I think that makes the story on Strictly even more interesting, you know, the journey, because, you know, he's getting better, he's working hard, I'm so proud of him every week, because it isn't easy, you know, to let it go, go on the stage and kind of make you know, weird moves with me <laughs> on the dance what about, floor. What, what about a woman telling him what to do when he's been a rugby player? So, what, Actually, how's I've, that? I've, I've, this is not my area at all. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, you well, know, you're I'm, married, I'm, aren't you? Yeah, <laughs> I'm, I'm, in fact, yes, married, house full of girls. I've got twin girls, so, yeah, I'm used to getting bossed about. So, yeah, I take that, that, that pretty well. Yeah, but, yeah. yeah it's, Very um, good student. It's, yeah, you've been good. She's been really patient, and um, you know, Swearing I struggled. Off. <laughs> <laughs> I struggled to put one foot in front of the other sometimes, and that, uh, that we're, could take an hour. we're gutted because apparently now there's no there's no chests, is there? Is that right? What? Well, it's what? just oh. a rumor. It's just a rumor, guys. Is it? So, are we so you have to watch this Saturday. Ah. Yeah. You better let me in on that then. What the <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, got to take one for the team. So. Yeah. <laughs> So the Paso Doble, I mean, I have to admit, having watched it over many years, mm -hmm. can sometimes be a bit of a comedy dance, can't it? Well, myself. yeah, I know where you're going with <laughs> it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes, of course, the famous John Sargent drag across the floor. <laughs> you know, little did I know it's going to become one of the most famous, favourite moments of Strictly Come Absolutely. Dancing, and I have to live with it for the rest of my life, being dragged <laughs> across the floor like a sack of potato, you know. <laughs> But oh well, you know, it's it's all it was a great fun to work with John, you know, and oh, he's I will cherish those memories John. forever mm. to be honest. Mm. You know? What are, do you think um you have the, a chance to win? I mean do you, being a sportsman obviously you want to win, don't you? What do you think your yeah, chances I, are? I, I set well, I set well, Christine don't want to hear this, but I set my bar very low and I read <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm in with a chance then, yeah. Yes. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> you keep your hands up there, right? Okay, sorry. I'm trying. <laughs> <laughs> Gripping my hands. <laughs> you do. Oh, oh, Thank you. Oh. Oh. Seriously. Hot flush. <laughs> <laughs> So what, what are we talking about? Think? What are we talking about? You've got a low um, bar. You're rugby about... players. <clears throat> yeah, I'm, do you know, I, I, I'm not so competitive as I was, and I need to find my competitive edge, I'm, I've got to say. But I woke up for 20 years playing rugby, being competitive day in, day out. So when I retired, that, uh, I sort of, that sort of competitive edge went a little mm. bit. So, um, yeah, Christine has been on at me. You know, like a scratch you can't get. <laughs> and, um, yeah, she's been on out. You know, got to get your competitive edge. So, how it? often do you rehearse then? How many hours um, a day? Every day, about six to seven hours Whoa. a day. Yeah, Monday through Thursday. We have four days to prepare the dance. Monday is usually really tough because I also have a professional rehearsal in the morning. So, we only have about three to four hours on Monday. Mm. And, you know, obviously, Ben also have hearing problems. Mm, so, yes. it, we do do lots of hours to make sure that, you know, everything is going good for Saturday night. Must oh. be hell for you, Christina. <laughs> <laughs> it's so you hard. Step in on that day. It's so yeah. cool. Yeah, it's a yeah. tough job, you know. Yeah, that's obviously. Him, so yeah, yeah. yeah. It is. <laughs> well, we wish you all the best sometimes. on Saturday. Really looking forward Thank to seeing you. Yeah. Thank and you all so the best. Much. Maybe you can win. Get yes. that bar higher. Yeah. As long as we have the Thank you so much. Join us tomorrow in Adventure. Ben Fogel will be here chatting about his new show, Animal Clinic. We'll see you at 12.30 tomorrow. Bye for now. <laughs>